everybody back today with guess what another box opening this is a special one guys i know most of mine are pretty special i say every almost every video on why they're special but this one's special to me because this is a ashton drake doll that has been retired and i have been looking everywhere for her like everywhere so this is a really special box opening um for me she's been highly highly wanted and this delivery was um, highly anticipated. So the uh, purchase of this doll went to a great cause. Um, I found the doll for sale on a group on Facebook and the lady that was selling it was moving her to open up some funds for more of her, the charity work that she does. It's called Little Dolls Cuddle Therapy and it's for um, Alzheimer's and dementia. Um, patients and she uses her dolls as therapy dolls and um, so she's got a really beautiful collection but she keeps things moving within it to open up funds to um, buy more things that she does donate to um, nursing homes and things like that so I'm gonna get started guys I've been talking already too long but I'm, I wanted to get this on camera and I wanted to give the person proper credit on where I bought this doll from and her cause is so awesome to me so I'm gonna go ahead and open up the package and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I got her on package. So, um, so this came from a lady named Marsha again. I'm gonna go ahead and start opening her up. Oh good, okay. So she put in what the name of the organization is. Little Angels Doll Cuddle Therapy Alzheimer's and Dementia Therapy Program. So this is um, something that she does. It's a wonderful cause and I was so happy to um, purchase this doll and have her proceeds towards her cause. So, this is, you guys, I'm so excited, but she doesn't have the original outfit, um, but you might be able to tell by some of the pieces that are included. Um, well, this is actually an aftermarket bib. I think this is the original outfit, but um, this is, actually the phone. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Daddy's little girl from Ashton Drake. I got her, guys. Like, oh my God, I wanted this doll so bad. She is so adorable. I wanted her so bad, guys. I even bought a knockoff. Do you guys remember that? I posted that video. I did not keep her. There were too many flaws. I did get a replacement. It was the same story. She's so sweet. Oh, how pretty. Look at that. She put a nice bow on her. She dressed, This dress was a, a custom dress that she got. I'll have to look up the name. So the name of um, the maker that made this doll, she's on Facebook also. She's called All Dolled Up Doll Clothes. And um, it is so cute. <laughs> so it's like the apron style. I think they're called pinafore dresses. And she's got the matching bottoms. Let me just take her out. Take her on out. Hey guys, so I just fully took her out of the box and I fluffed her hair up again with a little toothbrush. She's got curly rooted hair. It's a little frizzy, but that's kind of normal with the rooted fr uh, curly hair. Um, again, here is the business card for Marsha and her cause. It's a wonderful, wonderful cause. And she's totally inspired me to start doing something different with my dolls. So it's something I'm looking into guys, cause you guys know I've built a pretty large collection and um, if I can put my dolls to a better use, I would love to be able to do something like what Marsha does. So I just think it's amazing and wanted to tell her that and give her a great shout out. So I finally got daddy's little girl guys from Ashton Drake. I'm so, so, so happy. She's super cute. I love the little outfit that she sent her in. I'm super thankful that she sent her in such a pretty outfit. You guys know when I buy, um, secondhand dolls. I do like to change them typically, but there is no need to change her. She's in, a, in an adorable outfit. I'm going to go ahead and lay her down. She wants to lay down. So um, I'm really happy about that. She is as cute as expected. And I'm really, again, happy about that with her little dimples. She's a little girl. She's probably the size of a little of sweetheart or maybe Nora. She's pretty small. I'm gonna pull them in, guys. Let's do okay, it. guys, I pulled um, Nora, who I've turned into a boy. I took his hat off because it was kind of harder to see, but um, they're all about the same size. She might be a little bit longer than both of them, just limb-wise, the way her legs are stretched out. 
but the size of her head is about the same as both of them. Um, so that kind of, you know, puts in perspective. Most of Ashton Drake dolls are small guys. Like I, it's really hard to find anything over 20, 22 inches. Um, I'm noticing now that I've been collecting dolls a while, I realize I like dolls around 22 inches or so, somewhere in that range. And, um, they don't have a big supply of them. So it's like, you have to just accept that you're going to get a smaller baby from Ashton Drake. So um, that's what she looks like next to them. Um, I did redress Beach Baby again. You guys know I love my Beach Baby redressed. And I've got a little uh, forest theme going with her, or them, I should say. But um, I can go ahead and line them up to see like how big she, cause you guys know Beach Baby is like a big robust baby. But next to Beach Baby, I put her arms up cause they, all three of these dolls, all of these dolls have armature in them. But that's how she compares next to Beach Baby size-wise. And um, there's a big difference there. But again, these Beach Baby's robust. That's part of the reason why I liked her so much. And, um, but that's, that's her guys. I can't believe she's mine. I'm so happy to have her. What a little sweetheart. I know this one's called, this one's called Little Sweetheart, right? <laughs> But my goodness, she's a little sweetheart too. Yeah, I've had, I've had a lot of good experiences with the Ashton Drake dolls. I'm realizing that um, I've had some that I haven't liked so much, and and I've had some that I've really liked. Um, for Nora, guys, I straightened Nora's hair. Again, his this is Noah now, but and I had another silly name I was calling her, but I straightened the hair out on that doll because. The doll had curly hair like Daddy's little girl, but Daddy's little girl is nice and long, so it, it falls really cute. Where hers was like this short curly hair and it wasn't flattering, at least on the one I got, guys. I don't know if someone out there can comment that has a Nora, if you guys got a better one than me, but I didn't like the hair on my Nora at all. Like, I don't like it at all. So, <laughs> even straightened. It's better than it was, I guess. It's not as like frizzy and short. I like it a lot better. Um, but I do still kind of keep hats on him because, um, again, I'm not too much of a fan of it, but still cute. Still a cute little fella. Um, yeah, so those are my little Ashton Drake babies. And that's how they all look together. What a bunch of cuties. So I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. I know that she's an old doll. I know she's a retired doll. She was extremely special to me as she was a doll I've been on the hunt for for a long, long time. It seemed like as soon as I got into doll collecting is when they had just retired her. So I felt like I really missed the boat on her, but you know, where there's a will, there's a way. I'm a very extremely determined person. I've always been that way. If I put my mind on something, I will accomplish it. And I make a way, I always do. So um, here is <laughs> here is the fruits of my relentless pursuit of Daddy's Little Girl. She's uh, even hard to find on the groups because she goes so fast when people put her up for sale. So I was very fortunate to be able to purchase her. Okay guys, so I got her propped in her final form. I went ahead and just put my little um, flower sandals that I got from Ashton Drake on her, the little pink ones. And I propped her because she's got such a cute little dress with the ice cream and dessert theme. Looks like there's some ice creams and some sundaes and um, some soda. So I have this Neapolitan ice cream um, teething. Um, accessory that I'd gotten for one of my other dolls and I figured okay well let's prop her with it because she is so cute with her little theme so she is ready to find her little permanent spot in my room and she just looks too cute but um I really appreciate you guys watching and um, I know this is a uh, popular and retired doll guy so there's nothing special to see here but it is very special to me and I love how I was able to purchase her to go to a good cause so um, just wanted to share that information out there and um, I hope you guys enjoyed so thanks for watching please like comment and subscribe look forward to talking with you guys take care